Hey everyone, it's Monica with Kids Lids for my weight loss journey, Thursday, August 11th. So today has been a good day so far, um, although I felt kind of blah today and just needed to rest, I guess. I don't know why. It was just one of those days. So I haven't really done much. I'm still actually in my pajamas, as you can see. Cheap pajamas. <laughs> um, and sometimes I do that. If I'm having a blah day or a lazy day, I just sit at home and I crochet and I stay in my pajamas. And then in the evening, I actually have a shower and then change into new pajamas and go to bed. I know that's weird. But anyway, I love having a shower before I go to bed. So, um, what can I share with you today? Well, I had um, kind of a slushy um, this morning instead of my usual fruit juice smoothie with my fresh fruit in it. Only because I didn't have any fruit that I wanted. And we didn't go shopping because now we're going away tomorrow. So, um, we won't be here for th Friday, Saturday, Sunday because we're leaving early tomorrow morning. And I figured there was no point in going shopping and getting fresh fruit when it's not going to be fresh by Monday. Long story, sorry. But anyway, so I just put pomegranate juice, the pure pomegranate juice, um, and lemonade and ice cubes. And that was it. And it was really refreshing and it was so lovely to have that first thing in the morning. I had my bee pollen granules with the, um... Paradise Blend Juice, the Tropicana, and that is so good. That stuff is amazing, oh my goodness. And um, I'm going to go for a walk. Hopefully my stomach will allow me to because when I have pizza or really any kind of dairy, as you know, I'm trying to stay away from it, but I was craving pizza. So I had pizza. Anyway, I'm um, sorry, my eye is bothering me right now. So I'm going to be looking all funky in the camera. Sorry. Okay, I mean, like it. <laughs> there was an eyelash in my eye. There you go. Oh, let me fix my glasses now. So this really shouldn't go on here, and this should be a blooper reel, but I've attempted to record this so many times today that I'm just putting this up. So there you go. So, um, I had some wine gums, because a friend of ours bought us these wine gums um, quite some time ago, and we forgot that we had them. And oh, I'm very proud of myself that I didn't eat that whole bag because believe me, I could. But I was just craving something sweet. And then for my crunchy craving, because sometimes you just need, or you feel you need actually, I guess because you don't really need, you feel like you need something crunchy. So how I've been saying that I've been having this special K, which is vanilla almond, I'm telling you when I was craving chips today, that totally hit the spot. It was awesome. So I had not even a half a cup, like, you know, and it just really hit the hit the spot, like I said, sorry, spot, and um, with my ice water. I actually don't have my ice water here again today. Oh, my gosh. You know why? Because I had it in <laughs> my Magic Bullet cup. So um, I, uh, what else can I say? Um, if anybody out there uh, lives in the beaches who's watching, that would be extremely cool and we could meet up and go for walks. I generally go in the evening only because it's easier for me, but, um, or not easier for me, I guess just, it's just nicer in the sun to go when the sun's down, right? Uh, and right now it's it's almost down completely, which, will, which means it'll be beautiful outside for walking. We don't even have the air conditioner on today. We turned it off the other day and haven't had to put it back on. It's been so gorgeous. And um, yeah, so if you wanna walk, I usually, uh, or will stay in my area if, if that's um, possible just because it's easier I can do the beaches area so like Woodbine, Kingston Road Queen Street, Dundas Coxwell, Woodbine that kind of thing so let, yeah leave me a message and we can walk together we can be walking buddies that would be so cool and I'm waiting on a package to come that I ordered from I believe Hong Kong uh, Ms. Ray 210 hi She's so sweet. Um, she just started recording not long ago as well. So she is doing amazing. Um, and she had a package giveaway that she was giving away a bunch of stuff with a pedometer. But because she lives in the States and she wanted the packaging to get mailed to the person smoothly and everything, the winner could only be in the States. So congratulations to the winner. I can't remember who it was. But anyway, regardless. Um, so, of course, that made me really, really, really want a pedometer. So I went on eBay and found one for 99 cents. I'm hoping that it's good. <laughs> yeah. 
and I think the cost of the shipping was only about two dollars so the whole thing is only cost me three bucks honestly I mean, no I think it was 468 altogether in Canadian funds because uh, the US dollar is cheaper than the, the Canadian dollar right now so it was actually a good deal so I mean it looks like it's gonna be the normal size of a pedometer but I'm just worried that it's not gonna work properly let's just hope for the best and if it doesn't whatever it was only 468 so no big deal and I want to know how many of you out there use a pedometer and, um, you know, what what kind of walks you go on, how many steps you take in a day or something like that. Do I take it with me when I'm going to college? Because believe it or not, the walk from my bus stop to where I actually take my class sometimes can take me like a good 15 to 20 minutes because it's quite far. And the wings in the building are massive, as I said before. So when you're walking, you don't really think about it, right? But I mean, I guess because I'm not really power walking, I'm kind of strolling, I don't count that. But to me, I don't know. Anyway, just let me know your opinion if I should wear it to school or if I should just wait until I get home in the evening and wear it for my walk. So I think that's it for today. We'll keep it short and sweet. And I won't be here tomorrow morning. Um, wait, sorry, I said that wrong. I'll be here tomorrow morning and I'll record a video before we leave. But then we're going away to the cottage, so if all goes well. If Marina's feeling well when she gets enough, um, gets off the bus, sorry, then we're going to be going up north for the weekend to my parents' place. So I won't record for uh, Saturday, but then we'll be back Sunday so we can record something Sunday night. And then, um, yeah. So anyway, uh, I think my dad has a webcam, but I'm not sure. So that's why I'm going to say that I'm going to miss Saturday just in case. So I, that's it for today, and I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and thumbs up. And you guys rock. If you're in this weight loss journey with me, we're in it together, you're never alone. Please remember that you're never alone. There are so many of us out there who are doing a weight loss journey. Just message any of us, and we will send you some positivity, thoughts, prayers, love, and support. And that's what it's all about. It's all about supporting each other and being there for each other and letting each other know that we're in this together. Okay, so if you are in this with me, let's do this. Yay, we rock. All right, again, I love you guys. Share your smile. Bye, everyone.